This is Focus TV, straight to the point. And uh, it is a good morning to you people. How are you doing? This is East Africa. Kenya is the country. And my name is Mark Cloud Philip on Feed Up Show. Focus is the TV. I'm so blessed to have you. How are you doing? How was your night? Uh, some of us, uh, we had a very short night because we've been busy trying to make sure everything is running okay and we are having everything in order. Not forgetting my shout outs to my camera people in here having Yambura and uh, having Evans Mogendi and the DX Woodward Mihes and, uh, and, and, and Mr. Moses. We are so glad to have such great people and right away we're having Tuesday all right it is still chilly I don't understand what is wrong with this weather but I still believe there's a lot of uh, effort we can pull on to make sure we are warm and we are energetic we are strong and we can do this so literally what I want to mean on a tonic Tuesday it is a time when you rip your muscles you work on your muscles and you make sure your shape is all right and you look good so what I want to do is uh, is uh, is talk about Toning in details. Toning is all about, you see when you're lifting, God has created in a way that your bones need some effort and some intensity for you to, for you to look good. So when you're lifting, basically you're doing what? You're making sure that you're taking care of what you've been given by God. And, and, and when you see, maybe you're suffering from illness because of, uh, of weak immunity, because of weak bones, because of weak muscles, what you need is to do what? Is to work on your muscles by going to the gym. And, and this is the only show that has a structure. This is the only show that has a program. From Monday to Friday, we do different things. So today being on a, on a Tuesday is the day where we do what? Where we turn. And turning is all about making sure your muscles are ripped, are shaped, and are what? Yani misuli yako imechongwa ni nakatu vizuri. Kwa hivo wakati huni, wakati wakuenda katika nyumba na wazoezi. And then what do we do there? We rip. Let's go there. Right away. Now, today, I want to tell you, or I want to teach you how to work on your tricep. First, do you know what is tricep? Now, tricep is the behind my muscles on your hand. They are three, that's why we call them triceps. Now, in order for you to work them, you got to use equipment. And here, we want to take you through on how you use equipment to make your tricep shapeful and nice. Look at this. There we go, my man. There we go, my man. I right, lock. Now keep on squeezing it. Just curl it strong. Now, this is what we call tricep. Now, when you squeeze your tricep, just curl at 90 degrees. 90 degrees, squeeze it, and we keep on going. That's four. That's five. That's six. That's seven. That's eight. You can see the reaction. Yeah, that's how it's going. We keep on pressing. Now we got two more there. And we got one more. All right, job. Good job. I like that. Now, you take a rest as usual. Don't torture yourself. You take a short break in between the sets for you to continue even gaining more. So, onto the next set. After around 30 seconds, you take a rest. You don't want to kill yourself, you know? So, I want you to look good. And this is how we do it. Now, you can take the second set after rest too. Thank you. There we go. A lock. Remember, always you lock and then squeeze it harder. Nice job. Uh, a little bit more speed. A little bit more speed. You got three. Give me four. Give me five strong. Give me six. Yeah, keep it long. Give me seven. Give it eight. Give me nine. We got two more there. We got one. Nice job. Okay. All right. That was the second set. We are still going. One more set to go. Now, you can add more, a little bit of weight so that you feel the impact. Now, the last set is tricky, but you keep on, you need to grow. So you add more weight. Don't just stay there. Keep on growing. Look at this. And to the start set. All right. All my body, remember locking your hands. All right, squeeze it hard. You got two. We got three. We got four. Give me five. Give me six. Give me seven. It's not easy. Give me eight. Keep on pressing. Give me nine. Give me ten. You got two more there and out. Thank you. Well done. Mara, mara, body, mara. It is not easy. It has never been easy. But look, on Fit Up Show, we make it happen and happen for it. Now, on tricep, as you can see, it's not a workout that you can jump with. It's hard. You can see I'm trying to gain my stability, but before gaining it, I'm struggling. So, until next time, on the next muscle on Fit Up Show with Marco Philip. Uh oh, it's not easy. Thank you for watching. It is on.
awesome. It is wonderful. It is crazy. It is what? <laughs> you know what? There's, there's this cowboy inside me uh, and uh, this boy is ever crazy. This boy is ever funny. This boy is ever McLeod Philip, and it's a, it's a, it's a show like no other because this is a show like oh it is not easy <laughs> it is very easy when you get used to it because it is a, a culture it is a lifestyle it is something that is practical so wherever you're watching me from send your feedback to 22644 and make sure you're interacting with me by the way hi zola hi guys how are you doing my guys from kibunguri my guys from kiambu nairobi rongai ongata uh, ongata rongai uh, uh, naro kajiado all over the world uh whenever you're watching us also on facebook we are streaming live from focus towers uh, and we are humbled to have you it is my honor it's my desire that this show it, it's not a fancy show by the way you see there are no flowers here we don't have anything to touch at no 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 this is about uh, <laughs> struggling with your body until you get it right until you make it better so my desire is this look people people it's a higher time you talk to me talk to me for real talk to me tell me how is your experience at the gym what do you feel when you're there and who do you deal with there because people are at the gym some of them sorry to say but uh, for wrong reasons for wrong reasons in terms of uh, uh, some of them we want to look better than the other person some of them you want to show them that you're the best or the best you can lift the heaviest my friend my friend gym is not about competition gym is all about maintaining who you are and just being good and also helping others who are weaker to become stronger like you because in each and every extent everyone needs a what everyone needs a, a, a partner a partner in terms of unajua wakati mwingine unainua view malafu vina kwa vizito unashindwa unashindwa kuinua alafu unatamani eh jamani ingekuwa mtu alisaidie eh wakati mwingine naangaika nikiwa na uzito ambao niko peke yangu kwa kwa maana yake na kuomba uweze kuwa rafiki wengine wasaidie tu na si katika jumba la mazoezi peke yake pia hata huko nje kwa mambo mengine kusaidia watu wengine pia kuwa mwema panda mbegu ambazo ni nzuri na zitakapokuwa zitakuwa za maana na za kusaidia pia wewe and uh, that's why it's a higher time this is where people love so most this is where people love most because uh, it is a time where people want to do what people want to eat people want to eat people want to eat nutrifit time and on nutrifit is the time i went back to our core roots where we come from as africans uh, where we want to maintain and this is what this is all about this is all about uh, a nutrifit a nutrifit today goes huko huko kule tuliko talk kule huko ni wapi ushago ushago kuna mambo mengi kuna viazi tamu kuna nduma kuna wengine tunaita nguashe kuna mambo tu mengine yanavutia na yanapendeza na kwa ajili ya hiyo haya maneno yanaitwa vipi yanaitwa kasava kasava ama muhogo <laughs> muhogo ni chakula ambacho ni cha kipekee ni cha au kipati ovyo ovyo unakipata mahala ambapo tu ni palipa kipekee na kwa sababu ya hiyo nimekuandalia mafunzo came came ambayo yanaendeshana na mambo ya muhogo ama ukipenda kasava kasava ni chakula ambacho katika lugha kimombo tunasema ni carbs ama carbohydrates na kama ni carbohydrates kinakupa nguvu kinakupa nguvu ambazo zinapendeza nguvu ambazo ni ku nguvu ambazo tu ni za ajabu kwa hivyo watu ambao wanapenda ugali wa muhogo ukichanganyisha na mawele ukichanganyisha na na mahindi na wimbi pia na mtama ni chakula ambacho kina fatu sana so people who, are, who does not understand this is african language what i'm trying to say is uh, we today we are talking about cassava on nutrifit and on nutrifit is whereby we we we, we peruse we, we go step by step trying to dig deeper in understanding well what do we achieve what do we gain when we eat this and when we eat this where do we take it to and how do we utilize the energy so being on a, a very wonderful morning breakfast we got to take heavy breakfast because the day is too long ahead and we have a lot of things to do we need much energy so having a heavy breakfast is one of the best things you want to have so my wonderful viewer my beloved guys my silent fans who never talk Send in your feedback to 22644. Talk to me via the Facebook shout out. Send your shout outs in here and we're going to share them to your people because we are beloved. We are feeling grateful just to have you, just to have you doing what? Having you and uh, making sure that uh, every time we doing feel up show, you are together with me and uh, I want to take you to the kitchen for it. Cassava. Just go have one cassava baby. Nutri
Trefit, your nutritional partner with Mark Cloud Philip. Welcome to Nutrifit. Once again, it's a wonderful morning with me, Mark Cloud Philip. Today, I want to take you through a journey that after embarking from the journey, you will have learned much, much than expected. Today's topic is about cassava. Cassava? What is cassava? Cassava is a tuber where its roots is what is taken as meal. The leaves also serve as animal feed. You have your cattle there, you have your goats, you can use the leaves of a, uh, of a cassava, cassava sorry, for feeding them. Thank you. Cassava constitutes high level of carbohydrates. Carbohydrates are the, 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 the segment that gives you the energy to do a lot. So when you take cassava, you will have energy to do a lot in each and every day. Naturally, it's a gluten-free. This means you will have nothing to do with tummy crumbling and tummy problems because it is gluten-free. Thank you. Cassava also produces live flour that gives nutritious porridge. The flour that is ground from cassava, oh, what do I mean? Yeah, it's so true. Can also be mixed with millet and soga to produce brown ugali that keeps your tummy full the entire day. Ouch! Full the entire day. Who don't want to be full without eating here and there and there every time? That is what is going to help you. It feeds good gut bacteria and may lower your glucose levels. Look, when you eat cassava, you have assurance that you're going not to be suffering from tummy issues because it keeps you also healthy. It has a medicinal value. Let's move on. Cassava is one of the chief source of some essentials, mineral like zinc, magnesium, copper, iron, and manganese. These are very crucial. I won't go into details for minerals. I want to stay on cassava because I want you to understand what it is. Take it as breakfast or lunch for better health. The results are wow. I promise. I know. I have taken it before. The results are wow. In some parts, they say cassava is not good. It's a, it's, it has some kind of thing that won't help you. But I'm telling you, when you take it rightly, at the right time, cassava will bear you good, good results and you'll keep on loving it. It can be fried. It can be cooked, it can be boiled, you can take it as a snack, you can take it as lunch, you can take it as, as breakfast, and yeah, you will love it. Sometimes even we have crisps from cassava. Thank you for watching. Don't eat, test, eat nutrients. Every time on NutriFit, I am MacLeod Philip. Ciao. Nutrifit, your nutritional partner with Mark Cloud Philip. <laughs>